What is going on everybody? It's your boy Jay and welcome boom, man to another video man. Now today man we're back watching some disturbing FNAF VHS tapes man. And if you guys do be enjoying these videos man make sure you guys drop a like. Also comment down below letting me know. And then don't forget to hit that subscribe button while you're at it. But the first one we're going to be watching is called The Golden Years. Now you already know what I'm about to say. Make sure y'all grab a snack. And without further ado y'all let's go. Let's see what happens up in here, bro. This is the golden years. This is where shit was popping back Freddy, in the day. Are you awake? Freddy. <sighs> okay, good. I can't sleep because I'm afraid of Michael's gonna scare me. Or or maybe it will come back again. You the know, nigga William? The monster in the hall. If I go to sleep, it's gonna eat me. Pause. I hope Daddy can watch me blow up my candles and sing happy birthday to me. Boy, it seems like you need to blow your nose, bro. Freddy. Freddy? I wish Daddy didn't work all the time. Or does his dad get work for me? He comes home and okay, fights my bad. With Michael all the time. I miss Mommy. Damn. Daddy says she passed away when I was little. Sad. He said she loved us very much. Well, Michael didn't love her. Mm. He called her bad names. Like a bitch? Damn. Freddy. You'll never leave me. Freddy. Boy, you're talking to an animatronic. This is crazy. Good. I'm going to turn on the camera so I can see in the dark. Freddy. Shh. Be quiet. You don't want the monsters to get us, do you? No, homie imagining shit. Oh, then he can say, good, good, good. Hey, that's Freddy. What you mean, what was that? Did you hear that, Freddy? Yeah, that was me. Where is the flashlight? Come on, bro. Oh, here it is. We've been staring at this black screen. There we go. See anything, Freddy? Wait. Freddy wasn't here all along, bro. He was alone. Now it's here to hunt you. Take your soul. And you will never return back to this normal life. Be gone, child. Mmm, homie. Imagine seeing that in your door. What's your first instincts, bro? I'm going to keep it a buck with you. My first instincts is I'm looking for anything near me that I can use as a weapon. And I'm going to throw it exactly at his noggin. I'm going to throw it right at his noggin. And if that doesn't affect him, then step two, run like hell. <laughs> run like hell, bro. That's, that's the next step. Man, this party dead as hell. There's only two kids here. They might be playing the arcade game. Let me stop. These kids probably just like the hungry kids, you know, eating all the pizza and shit. The other kids are having a blast now and shit. Hey, I don't know what I just said, but they're having a blast now and shit. Happy birthday, Norman. Are you excited about turning 11? I guess so, Charlie. Thanks for coming to my birthday, by the way. You're the only one that showed up. Damn. Norman, that's not true. Look at everyone that showed up. No, those are some good people, but my dad asked to go to my party. And some of the kids at the arcade are my brother's friends. Oh. Uh, I told you people was at the arcade, but those are all his brother's friends, so that's tough. I came, and I'm glad to be here. I love Fred Bear. This is the coolest place ever. Well, I don't. What? I thought you liked this place? You get to play the arcade games for free. You get to eat as much pizza as you want. And you get to listen free to the awesome music. That's every kid's dream. Not mine. I just want my mom back. Aww, I just want my mom oh. back. I forgot your mom is in heaven. Sorry, Norman. Hey, I know what will cheer you up. Let's watch Fred Bear and Bonnie sing a song and then maybe your cake will be ready. 
I don't like animatronics. They're scary. Come on, Norman. You need to go to the arcade game and get Your lit. Dad built them. You're gonna hurt you, they Hey, are you okay? You barely touched your pizza. I couldn't sleep. My dad took me to the hospital the other day, and they gave me medicine for something. What did they give you medicine for? Boy having I, these scary I, ass I, nightmares every it night. It was a big word. But now I see monsters in my room, and he wouldn't eat me. That's not good. Hey, I almost forgot. I got you something. You, you did? I got you a puppet show VHS tape, a collection, so we can watch it together tomorrow. Word? Oh, we got a date. <laughs> well, w. Thanks, Charlie. You're my best friend. I hope we're friends forever. This is about to be. This is about to turn sad. Uh -oh. I ain't gonna lie. What's wrong? I see Michael, and he's coming over. Mm mm. Your brother better be like, hey man, what you doing with this lame ass girl, man? Come over here and play the games with the real niggas. <laughs> How much did we make in June? Okay, so we sold around 40 tickets every weekend for 10 bucks each. There was about four weekends last month. So that's 1,600 plus a change from the arcades and the food orders. So that's about 3,000 even plus 42 cents in change. You're kidding, right? What? That nigga mad. That's it? You made sure you counted the requested songs from the parents and the, and the drinks? Yeah, I have it all written down right here. God fucking damn it, Henry! <laughs> We're barely gonna be able to pay the bills and keep hey, the electricity William, calm down. for the robots! Calm down, okay, William. Well, just calm down. We'll cut back on the spending on the arcade machines, and you could bring out those other animatronic models you created a while back. <sighs> Henry, we can't just cut corners. Otherwise, the kids aren't going to show up if all they're playing is Pac-Man and Donkey Kong for the next five years. I need you to purchase those games that came out this year. What were they? Mappy and, uh... Fuck, what was it? Super Mario Brothers? Yeah, that one. Thank you. How can you forget Super Mario well, Brothers? Just to keep the kids entertained with the games. Uh, I heard a few days ago a Japanese company invaded a... A gaming system you can play at home. I think they called it the uh, Nintendo. Don't worry about that. What was it you said about the animatronics? Uh, I suggest we use those models you had in stock in the ports of service room so we could just earn that little extra money, you know? Also, dude, if those things could walk and interact, that would bring a ton of profit from the people out of town, don't you think? No, it's too risky. They're not done yet, and there's a chance they could malfunction yep i don't need some kid getting mauled to death by a purple <laughs> bunny or a yellow chicken <laughs> hey he already hit i'll have you know i've been thinking of scratching that entire section of robots and creating new small cheaper ones that would send our profits through the roof well i trust you what about the food uh, any complaints from the customers or anything like that I only heard that our night guard Steve and her teenagers joking around that the shit in the pizza is made from blood and bones. What? I swear to God, if I find out Michael has been spreading rumors, I'm gonna kick him in the ass. Speaking of Michael and Norman, how they doing? My oldest son is still a rat bastard who I should have left behind long ago. God, Lee. But Norman, he could be better, I guess. He can be better. Why? That is tough. I took him to the hospital the other day because he wouldn't stop screaming and claiming there was a giant golden bear with huge fangs in his room. But I guarantee you, it was my oldest son scaring him again. I say that because a week ago he hid behind the family TV with a foxy mask and scared the ever-living shit out of him. Oh, this is like the real lore on the FNAF 4. Yeah, tell me about it. Hey, what time is it? It is... 5.56 Okay, well at 6, can you put on the audio tape I have programmed for the animatronics? Because I'm gonna bring out his cake and wish him a happy birthday. Alright, 
I'll make sure Charlie and I are singing out there along with you guys. Hey, there he is, the birthday mm -hmm. boy himself. Hey, tell me, how does it feel to be one step closer to the grave, bitch boy? <laughs> <laughs> to the Please grave is crazy. Not today. And why are you wearing those masks? Well, because we're the entertainment tonight. And boy, do we have a gift for you. What gift? Well, we have decided that since you're such a big fan of Fred Bear, we wanted to show you something special. In fact, so special, you'll never forget this day for you fucking down. No, his brother is an ass. Shut up, ass white. Grab her and I'll grab more. Let's wow. get this party started. And then this was the print where he put his head in. Okay, yep, he put his head inside of, and he, it was a bite. Oh my god. Michael, please, let me go. Let me go. Time to give Fred there a big kiss. Ready? Michael, put him down. One, two, three. Mmm. Hope you remember this, buddy, because now I'm on that ass. Hope Henry, you know, fucks up his brother. Oh my god. Thick. Thick of being sick. That's crazy, bro. What the hell is that? I don't know why they look like. I don't know. I can't really like. Oh, di oh, that's Henry for sure. That boy leaking. They put Henry in the puppet. So then that's why, oh wow, Norman Afton was murdered. Oh, I said Herman, whatever his name is, my bad. It was killed on, damn. So both of them was killed was crazy. My guy then was charged with murder in the first degree at 17 on August, damn. The owner of Frederick William Anthem and Henry Emily will appear in court. And by dang. That's tough. That was dope though. Shout out to the craze, bro. We're gonna go ahead and watch one more before we wrap this up. Are right, y'all? Alrighty, y'all. This one's called Pure Torture. Backroom found footage. Now okay, okay, they found Freddy in the back room, so this is a little different. This has nothing to do with the lore. But yeah, let's get straight into it. I am very far underground. Uh, I'm just searching. Huh. I toast to silence. Searching for what, my boy? Okay. What is that? <laughs> oh, oh my god. Oh, a slot machine. Interesting. <laughs> so, Freddy Fazbear is no clipped through the back rooms. It's weird. This is what I'm getting from it. Hello? Oh, he's looking at you now. Hello? What the fuck? What you better start that? running. Hey, homie, screaming for real. You gonna stop walking? Or running a minute? Wait, there's mo- Wait. Ooh. Where the hell Freddy go? Where did the Freddy go? That's a big ass tsunami. Hey, homie is yelling off the top of his. He's dead. I'm 
Where the hell did Freddy go, bro? Hmm. You in the wrong area right now. This is a, a terrible back room to be in. I mean, you got water to drink now, nah, unless that's um, salt water, you know. Damn. Bitch started breaking the sound barrier. Yeah, homie about to just drown down there. I'm not even gonna cap, bro. He's done for. You just hear him yelling in the distance. <laughs> so first it was about Freddy, and then it became a big-ass flood. It was not even about Freddy no more. It was about this nigga just drowning. <laughs> well, y'all, this will be the end of the video, man. If you guys did enjoy this, man, make sure you guys drop a like. Also, comment down below, let me know. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button while you're at it. And I'll see you on the next one, man. Peace. Love y'all.